Right, the reason for this video, it stretches back to 2004, where I stopped paying the licence fee because I stopped watching my broadcasts. Now, did you know that you could actually opt out of the licence fee these days if you just stop watching my broadcasts? It's called legally licence free. Don't need a licence. But the BBC and Greedy Capita um, extort the licence fee so from the public, they don't like that. So um, I've been in trouble with them ever since. Uh, I, the way they deal with people like me is they, like, they constantly write to you, they constantly battle on the door. Buy a licence, buy a licence. So in 2006, I withdrew their implied rights of access under English common law. Now that's called a warrant. That was issued in 2006. In 2010, because they totally ignored it and kept coming, I issued it again. And since 2010, it still kept coming, knocking letters. So in 2010, I issued another warrant. Ever since this started, this fire started in 2004, I've had 110 letters and 20 visits, and four of those visits was spaced one month apart in the last year, 2017. Uh, that's where I made my clown dooms video, if anyone wants to watch that. Two jokers, I tend to um, Because I've been a bit of an activist and a bit of pain in the side, in 2010 they took me to court. Uh, and what they did to gain the conviction to both beef up the case, sex up the case, they looked at my YouTube video, took a home video of my, my living one, and they superimposed a uh, frozen image from the one show. That's what all the one show jokes are about on the internet. And then, like, people couldn't believe it. I couldn't believe it at the time. Like, What's that in there? Like, was it, a, was it a, a DVD I was watching or something? Anyway, it turned out in court, it's all proved in court, that the show that they'd taken a frozen image from wasn't even being broadcast on the day that, of the alleged offence. So it couldn't possibly be. Something was fishy, something was wrong. That evidence was fake. So... Um, after the court case ended, I think that would be the end of the visit, I smashed them in court, I caught them with their pants down, they are doing all this stuff. After the end of the saddle stuff came out, so people started to realise how low they could go with the BBC, what kind of sick company they were. So, but um, physics kept coming and coming and coming, the letters kept coming. I was so sick of it, I thought, look, every time I write to them, they delay and it takes a long time and they bluff and they bluster, they don't answer the question. So I thought, see this woman, she runs TV licensing, she's the top person. So it was like, um, I thought, look, maybe the letters and stuff, that's not the way to go. I'll have a little chat with her. So I found her office, I have a chat with her, she works here. She works from home. I thought, oh, untouchable, right? Like, can't get in touch with her, ignoring my letters, can't talk to her on the phone. So I thought, right, about four clicks of a button on the internet and her, her actual home address is in the public domain. You can find it so easy. So I thought, right, that's so big. I'll, I'll go around there. She works from home. I'll go around there and have a chat with her. Not, not nasty, like just a chat. Much as I'm trying to check now. So, anyway. I wrote a letter, so I thought, if she's not in, I'll pop the letter around the door. In the door. So, anyway. I go to the address, knocked on the door, and they go and get one. I said, well, I thought to myself, well, don't work for the BBC, I'm not paid if I've been, been all over if I was, but. I just thought to I said, oh, is your mummy? Yeah, yeah, I'll give her this letter. Bang, I went. Two minutes. Cool, so that was it. Um, three 
guys like her. Got a bang on the door. So I feel. As a result of this one visit to her home and this one letter, she made a harassment case statement against her saying it caused her so much distress. This one visit, this one letter, caused her so much distress. Like she wanted to be nicked for harassment. Basically, they can't nick you unless there's two or more incidents. So I was lucky there. But, um, just watch the video that I made when the clods come and um, take everything else into account and see what you think. Hello there, all right? Don't mind if I film you there? No. I don't know, anyway, is it? Is it Michael? It is, yeah. Okay. Um, we've got something to issue you. Okay. Oh, okay, yeah. Do you want yeah. us to do it here or do you want us to do it inside? I don't know what you mean, issue so, me. So, basically, we've had a call from Thames Valley Police. Oh, right. So, a different yeah. police force to us. Um, to say that you've sent a letter to someone on the BBC. That's right, yeah, we've been corresponding for quite a while, yeah. Oh, right, okay. So, basically, they've asked us to issue you the harassment warning. Oh, right, okay. Yeah? yeah. So, do you want us to do it here or do you yeah, want us to come fine. in? Yeah, that's fine. Here? Okay. So, basically, it's for you. Your, your name and address is on there and your date of birth. Um, you sent a letter which has been hand delivered either by yourself or a third party. This letter is unwanted outside of the official channels of the BBC and has caused me by distress. Oh this, right. This conduct is contrary to the protection from her. She's never she's 19, never said that before to me. No? No. Oh okay. Um so basically this is a harassment warning. Yeah. Okay, which means the police have received an allegation of harassment against you. I haven't harassment harassed is any behaviour on in at least two yeah. occasion which causes alarm or distress. At least else. sorry. Harassment is any behaviour on at least two occasions. I haven't I've been there twice. Okay. Yeah. Um, at this stage, the police are not commenting on the truth of the allegation. Instead, this notice is being given to you in spirit of crime prevention. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah. And to make yeah. you aware that if any kind of behaviour described were to continue, then you'd be liable to arrest and prosecution. You should be aware that if further such behaviour resulted in prosecution, then the behaviour complained of above could be referred to or relied upon in any subsequent proceedings. This notice is neither a court order nor a criminal record, but will be kept by the police for the purpose of any future investigations and retained in accordance with national guidelines on the management of police information. So on the basis of white one letter, there's, there's classing it as harassment? Yeah. That's, that basically, basically, it's not it's not come from Essex Police, it's Thames Valley Police have received the information and they've asked us to issue it or not on their behalf. But it does say right. two or more, yeah? So on, on here it does, yeah. So I don't, at the moment... Well, I mean, I don't know a little bit about her. So I don't know whether you've received so. because she said that the contact's unwanted. We've just come Yeah, but she's never told me that. We're here, obviously, just to tell yeah. you that it's unwanted. But if I could write to her and say, further, like, why didn't yeah, you say it before? No, no. don't write. Because obviously, that's the allegation that is causing her harassment. So this is just us giving you a. So warning. could I do the same thing then? Just to say, not, not to her, her, her agents have been here a few times. And I've said, you're harassing me and, and you're. Causing me concern and distress. I've said that to her. Yes, yeah, because obviously she's made the, the complaint, so we're just giving you a warning. Right, no, but I'm just I'm just a bit confused. It seems a bit okay. one sided at the minute. Because um, this has like, been going on for quite a while. Like we said, it's, we're not commenting on it. Yeah, um, but if I can just that... tell you, so you know the other side of it, yeah? Mm -hmm. She works for the BBC, yeah, but she works from home. So when I phone up, they tell she's working from home. So there's no other way of getting in touch with her. Um, but if she's saying that, that's fine. Yeah. She... That is, yeah. yeah. So if she's saying, like, yeah, that so she doesn't want the car... Just to tell her, just to yeah. contact her, because it's obviously she doesn't want it anymore, OK? And then it will just leave it at that, all right? Right, if you could just sign there, then, to say you understand. So underneath, again, it says, this is not an admission or acceptance of... No, I can't, I'm not going to sign anything without um, legal advice. If that's okay. all right. Is that all right? You don't have to sign it, but this has been issued to you. Okay, okay? then, yeah, which, I'll take which, that. Which basically means that um, you, if you contact her any further, then you could, have re could be arrested. I was going to go tomorrow. All right. <laughs> that's yeah, strange. Yeah, no, don't yeah. go tomorrow. Because she never said it caused her distress at the time. Right. Okay. Strange, well, isn't it? We're just here issuing that now to say it, it has. So just Are you recording me at the moment? Um, I'm not, no. No, okay. So just, just contact her. I don't any mind further, if you do. Okay? Yeah, so other than other than that, don't you have no more contact so what with us, about, it's been I mean, issued to you yeah. now. So, so this is a criminal thing, no, yeah? No, like I said, 
when I read that out to you, it's not. It's not no, no, it's a criminal. Is it a criminal offence? Harassment is a criminal offence. But why didn't she say just to me to withdraw my rights of access under English common law? Why didn't she say, I don't want you to knock on my door anymore? Because I said that in the letter. I said, if you say to me, you don't want me to come here anymore, I won't come here anymore. Uh, she's obviously not wanted to do that and she's gone down the police route. So this has been issued today. Yeah, yeah, no, I know what you're so trying to do, your contact, job, yeah, yeah, but I'm trying to get my head round why it's happened all of a sudden. Yeah. Because it's been going on for, we've been corresponding for quite a while. Right. But obviously it's just us saying today not, not to contact her any further. What do you mean contact, even write to her? Yeah, don't. But, but I've got to though, because no, we've don't. got an unresolved issue. Well then you'll have to contact someone else. Do not contact her because you're going to end up getting yourself in trouble. That's why I've issued this. To stop yeah, I mean, I know you're being fair, and I'm, I'm confused because there is like an issue, obviously, between yeah. us. That's why I'm corresponding with her. Yeah, but the, so the my, see, problem. my issues yeah. unresolved. My issues unresolved. You need to go about it a different way, then. I don't know what, what your issue is with her, but you need to. I mean, it's not serious. I'm not a nutcase or anything like that. I'm, I'm 61 years old. I'm not violent. I've got no you can record. Go by and resolve it that way. Yeah. Because yeah, obviously she's made a complaint that she doesn't want any contact from you. So. And who's this? So you cannot send any more letters BBC. to her because it will end up getting you in trouble. Yeah. So that's why we're just here today. So other this point, so, you don't so, contact you. Yeah. It means you don't contact so me by letter, go I to mean, address or anything like that. She's supposed no to be replying contact. to me. Is she going to reply to me? Or? If, if she's replying it's not to really me, fair. it's doubt. not really fair if she's going to yeah, leave I, it all I up in the air, is yeah, it? But you're going to have to resolve it some other way because it's just going to get you in trouble, okay? Yeah. So from this point forward, don't no write contact letters, at all. Don't visit her address, nothing. No? No. Okay then. It gives me a little bit of a problem because I do have to resolve... The issue that I've got. Else, then. Yeah. Do you know who that would be at all? No, I don't. I don't. I don't even know who this person is. She works for the BBC, I'm assuming. Yeah. Yeah, she um, does. Yeah. I don't know who yeah. she is. I just have to find out by other means. Okay. But don't contact but if, her. But if you contact her again and then she reports it to Thames Valley Police, then it could mean that they come and arrest you for it. Right. All right. Okay. Okay. So can anyone do this to anyone? Like if people come to my dog, could I do the same thing? So, yeah. yeah. No, I'm not being flippant. It, it, there's been a couple of instances where BBC staff have come here and harassed me for, for, for other things, but it, I'm a bit shocked, really, that she's jumped the gun, I think, because I've, I've let them come here. I've withdrawn their rights of access three times, mm -hmm. uh, and I've asked them, I said, you're causing me, di me distress, don't, please don't come here, but they keep sending people here. And that's the issue I want to try and resolve. What's the, what's the, why have you got... Well, I don't really... Music? Like you're saying, you don't want to discuss it. I don't really want oh, to right, discuss okay. it, yeah. Well, that's issued now, all right? So, from, yeah. from 10.39 on today's date, don't have any more contact. Um, otherwise, you could be liable to arrest. I, all right? I appreciate that. Um, we're going to take this. All oh, right. Um, we have to oh, don't put we have refuse, because I haven't refused. I've declined to sign here. Yeah, refuse to sign. Not refuse, no. It's, it's decline. OK, we, we put refuse to sign because you've said you don't want to sign. Because that sounds a bit worse, is it? You're going to make it worse it's, for it's me, yeah? It means the same thing. Decline to sign, refuse to sign. just well, means you don't want to sign Why didn't you put decline, then? It says to make me look worse. No, Are you no, on her what, side? That's what we put. That's what we put. Because I get a bit... Refuse to look, sign. My hands are shaking there. Yeah, but no, because I wasn't expecting none of this. Yeah, yeah. But that's fine. Okay, so it's been issued. Could, could I put decline to sign on it? It's, it's, it's fine. It it's means fine. exactly the same thing. It just means out. that we've that you don't want to. Because I'm it. I'm cooperating with you. I'm yeah. not refusing. I'm it's, not being yeah, awkward. That's fine. Yeah. That's fine. Yeah. We'll send it back to Thames Valley. We'll say it's been issued. All right. All right then. Thank All right. You. Thanks a lot.